This is Balawake and welcome to another tutorial. This time we'll do the Sports Center intro. This is Sports Center. What you'll need Adobe After Effects CS5 or higher, Blender from Blender.org, and the template files from the link in the description below. So let's get started. First extract the downloaded zip folder, then open up the extracted folder and choose between either a very short version, a medium length version and a long title version, depending on the number of characters in your desired title. I'll show you how to create a long title. Depending on your title length, you can also change the font size down here and the character space down here. When you open up the file, it will look like this. Make sure your mouse is in the 3D view and then press tab. You can now delete the default adjustment layer that I've put up and enter your desired title. And press tab again. Now you'll have to edit the actual individual letters here. Select them by right-clicking and press tab and change it to your desired letter. Do this for every single letter. Depending on which two main letters you want, You'll have to edit the B and the C in this template. So I want the B and the T of Ballet Tutorials to be the two main letters. So I'll have to change these and then delete the letters that I don't want. Now keep editing. Now if you run out of letters, select the last letter, then use the key combination Shift D and then left click to confirm. Right now this looks like a mess, so we'll have to move the letters into position. Right click on them and then use the red arrow to move them into position. They should match the adjustment title that's in the background. Now when you're done moving around the individual letters, right click any letter until you select the big title and move it up. Now you'll have to insert a location keyframe for every individual letter. Do this by right clicking and then pressing I and left click on location. When you've done that, you can delete the big title on top by pressing delete. Don't forget to save this file from time to time so you don't lose your work. Now let's move on to the next step. Press this little icon down here and then select Dope Sheet. Here you will have to individually select every keyframe that is behind the green line here. First right click any empty area and then start selecting the keyframes by holding shift and pressing right click. Move further down by using your middle mouse wheel button. Now 
and that should do it. Now press Shift D. And move the keyframe duplicate on top of these that are here at the end. And left click to confirm. Now to go back to 3D view, go down here and select 3D view. Now you can check if everything's all right by moving around in the timeline down here. If something seems out of place, like this T that goes into the B here, just move it and then press I and insert a location keyframe. There we go. Now you've got your title animation and you're almost done. Press the render tab here. Don't change any of these render settings and press animation. This starts rendering your title. This takes a few minutes and then you can move on to the next step. After the rendering is done, you will end up with a lot of PNG files in a render folder. Now open up the Sports Center After Effects file in After Effects CS5 or higher. Here I'll just go through the same procedure. Add to render queue. Click on lastless. Select H.264. Check audio output. Click OK and then click render. You'll now have your custom Sports Center intro rendering. I hope you liked this tutorial, favorite and subscribe, and see you again soon. Bye.